do you not understand how, how, especially being new in this country, that, that this, is, this is stepping on toes and undercutting. We don't need any other barbers in town. Why? You come other town. I live here. How long you live here? How long have I lived here? Mm -hmm. What do you mean? I live in a Soyuz. So what? Why do not you have a barber shop in Oliver? Why would you bother coming here? Why would you do that? Especially right next door. If, if that was me next door, there's no way you'd be open here. No way. It's, it's called... He gave me city license, see. Your license? Yeah. I can't, I can't believe that. Did they know that you were opening next to a barbershop? Yeah. Wow. That's, uh... <laughs> it's business, you know... Wrong go on every level. I know. You know, go for a mall. In what? Go for anywhere. Somewhere next door, every barbershop. Where? Say that again. What? You go for, uh, you know, big cities. Yeah, but this is not a big city, um, Sir, Sir G. This is a small town. There's already Bob, Mike, and me. And we're all good. We don't, there, nobody needs another barbershop here. But especially to offer to $15? Why would you do that? Like, Sir G, okay, let me explain it to you this way. That's like me going to India and, and being a new guest in the country and then totally disrespecting your people and not caring um, about what other people thought. I would probably be shot in, in a country like that. So it's called having respect for people in a small town. It doesn't matter where you live. It does not matter where I you know. Live. I respect for people. My prices, then I respect no, people. No, that's not having respect for people who are already in business. It's, it's one thing to open right next door to a barbershop. That is extremely ballsy and so disrespectful on every level. But to put a sign out there for $15, no.